Hey everyone, this is the start of the SimTune Tutorials video series. So this is episode one and we're just going to be doing an overview of SimTune. So really to start things off and to answer the question, what is SimTune? SimTune is a software that was uh, designed and built to provide a simulated environment where you can practice PID tuning uh, on different process scenarios. So really that's the core of SimTune. Um, it's actually these simulation modules here. Uh, and since then, it's kind of grown into some other things like the IO modules, uh, process model identifier tool, historical trend tool, and then we've also written some manuals for it. Um, so this episode is just going to be a quick view of what those are and how to get to them. And then in the next episodes, uh, we'll be taking them one by one and showing uh, how to use them. So let's go over to SimTune. So this right here is the Simple Flow Simulation. It's the first module of the Simulation Modules Library. And you can get to all the other modules by coming here to the drop-down menu. And you can see we've got them grouped by Beginner, Intermediate, and Advanced. And we recommend starting with the simple ones and moving on because it just kind of builds on itself, both in terms of complexity of the process and also adding more techniques that you'll need to use to successfully tune the PID controllers. Uh, so that's the simulation modules. The IO modules are very sim similar to the simulation modules. It's just instead of uh, simulating the process, you have a, an external kit, an Arduino kit, that you connect to and you're actually doing real temperature control on an actual process. Then after that, we've got these tools, uh, the process model identifier tool, where you can load in uh, process data and identify a model of the actual data. And that's pretty handy because a lot of SimTune is based on models. So once you identify a new model of like your actual process, you can load that into, say, the simple flow simulation and run the simulation based on that model that, that you identified. Then after that, we've got the trend recorded data. And this is just a historical trend tool where you can load in data and it's just a quick, easy way to view the data and analyze it if you want to. Then after that, we've got various manuals like the concepts and capabilities. It's a quick overview of SimTune, so what you can expect, just like this video. So if you're still trying to figure out what SimTune is and what it offers, uh, check out this manual. Then after that, we've got the SimTune user manual. And the SimTune user manual doesn't, still doesn't go into uh, PID tuning per se, but it goes more in depth into the interface of SimTune itself and how to do different things, how to use different tools. For example, with the, uh, with the trend tool, it, it teaches you or at least gives you instructions on how to format your file before loading it in, uh, that sort of thing. And um, it's pretty... Uh, pretty comprehensive, so if you're trying to figure out how to use something, uh, go ahead and check out this manual. Then we also have, you might have noticed, uh, SimTune tutorial videos. Uh, you're probably watching this video on YouTube. Clicking this button will take you to YouTube with uh, to a page with the library of SimTune videos. So hopefully you can find what you're looking for there. And then lastly, we've got uh, the PID tuning guide. And this, especially if you're new to PID controllers, we recommend uh, checking this one out because it, uh, it's a good introduction to PID controllers and how to tune them, uh, what each of the terms are and, and what they do. But then it also includes uh, open loop and closed loop tuning techniques. And finally, something we highly recommend checking out, Dale's closed loop PI tuning technique. Um, so this is a pretty good, quick uh, manual that we recommend using as you're going through the different simulations so that you can uh, learn more and put them into practice with this simulated environment. So this is SimTune in a nutshell. Like I said, the next few episodes, we'll take them one by one in the order that we presented them and just show you how to use them. So we hope you enjoyed this video and we hope you enjoy SimTune and I'll provide some links in the description below. So thanks for watching.